Now imagine living in a world where the average person reaches the age of 200 and aging has been cured. How would things be different? Would you retire or maybe retire more than once? How does a longer lifespan affect the decisions that you make in your later years? Now these are exactly the questions being explored in a captivating new podcast <coughs> series called The 200 Year Old, starring Tapelo Mokwena and of course Nambita Mpulwana, who's not with us today, but Tapelo is, along with the executive creator creative director of the ad agency behind this incredible concept, Dan Pinch from King James Group, who joins us on Expresso this morning to share more about this incredible concept. Gentlemen, how are you? Yeah, yeah, the 200-year-old, yeah. I've seen this. I've seen this. People are talking about this. It's so yeah. incredible. But Dan, don't you want to just contextualize for us, where did this idea sprout from? Yeah, so it's, um, it is a piece of science fiction, but hopefully yeah. it's a useful piece of science fiction yes. for people that you know, wouldn't necessarily watch or listen to this kind of thing. It's yeah. about how do we deal with the challenges and opportunities of the world ahead of us. And if you kind of paint this picture, this kind of fictional picture, um, that's, that's kind of what we want to do to make people think about yeah. the future. So it's all based on real science, real experts. We've done tons of research. Wow. And then we fictionalized it and brought amazing talent to bring it to life. And there's the amazing talent sitting right next <laughs> yeah. to you who plays the voice of Sam Nguyenia. Yeah. Tapella, don't you want to tell us more about the character that you voice? Well, Sam Nguyenia is pretty much um, the anchor who runs this podcast mm. um, that looks into this life of this 200-year-old. Yeah. And of course, at the top of this narrative, um, Sam Nguyenia introduces us to the 200-year-old. Mm. And then we go into this world, and then we start sort of transporting our minds into 2218. Yeah. It's for me, it's just like a beautiful way to, you know, to add escapism yeah. to storytelling, and I love that. and and he's really an incredible character. Yeah. And we get to know Sam more as we go along as well. And ask really important questions. I mean, what Absolutely. would life be like? What would your life decisions right? be like if you weren't working with a 60-year span? Like, by yeah. the grace of God, if we do live to that age, Absolutely. but you knew that you were, you had 200 years ahead of you. Um, Dan, what has been the reception to this concept, to this podcast? Because I know podcasts aren't necessarily huge in South Africa. Mm. It's still growing. But yeah. what have people been saying? Yeah, so like um, podcasts have like really exploded over the last few years globally, and yeah. I think a lot of South Africans are listening to global podcasts. Yes. I think people are really excited to get a South African produced podcast, Finally. entirely written here, entirely produced here, entirely acted here. So, um, but like a major podcast series, a, you know, a scripted series with amazing sound design. So I think mm. the, the we've hit number one in the podcast charts in yeah. our first week, which is it's amazing. amazing. Yeah. So yeah, I mean, hopefully this is our podcast moment where you know South Africa yeah. gets its moment to shine. Now for both of you, since you have been dealing with the research and the science and looking into where life is going, from your perspective, Tapelo, playing Sam, where yeah. do you think we see life going and how we view the future from here onwards? Well, until this series, I never really thought about yeah. about that that approach to to what life could be mm. i just think it's incredible you know um it also allows us to just start thinking beyond yeah. you know beyond the average lifespan of a human being what if which is what storytelling allows yeah. us to do you know it takes us to whole new worlds and whole new dimensions yeah. who knows who knows but once you start thinking about it it triggers something I you know it, it I triggers something and yeah. i think that's the idea yeah mm. and for you dad I think it's like really um, looking at it and looking at all the different research, it's how it all comes together. You start layering things like yeah. artificial intelligence, people living for much longer, yeah. um, all of these things and seeing, well, how do they all play against each other? Mm. So I think the most interesting thing for me is like seeing how it's not just one thing about the future, but it's, yeah. it's all of these trends now and how they project into the future. Yeah, that's yeah. powerful. And at the same time, you know, enjoying the now as well, yeah. you know, and appreciating what you have. So that's wonderful. Thank you so much, gentlemen, Thank you. for, yes. of course, opening up our minds to this amazing concept of the 200-year-old. She's already been born, y'all, and I love it that it's a she. Yes, <laughs> the woman of the world. Well, the 200-year-old, the future-facing podcast series takes a glimpse into what a longer life could look like, and it stars Tapelo Mokwena, and it can be listened to by heading over to the 200-year-old.co.za. Go and check it out.